All right, I'm going to quickly go through how to add a mega tree to Vixen 3.0.6 and later. First, we're going to configure the element in the group. Um, here's uh, all the all the uh, elements we have and groups we have defined here. So to add a mega tree, I'm going to just right click on some white space in this box. And you'll notice the first time I click, it picked the, the candy canes. What I'm really trying to do is pick white space here that doesn't have anything in it. And I'm going to pick Add Display Item, Mega Tree. I'm going to add a Mega Tree. Mine's going to have 12 strings. There's going to be 50 lights per string. Press OK. You see down here, Mega Tree is created. There's 12 strings. Each string has 50 lights in it. Press OK. We're going to skip controllers. We're going to skip patching because we don't care about that right now. We'll jump right down to configure preview and add a new preview. Fix and display preview. And then go back to the screen. Make sure that one we just added is highlighted. Click configure preview. And add a background picture. And then turn the uh, intensity down on that. And then we will scroll down our mega tree here at the bottom. Click on it. Click the mega tree icon up top. Draw our tree. Now I want a 180 degree mega tree. So what I'm going to do is increase the string count here. I'm going to double it to 24. I'm going to make that 180 degrees. You'll see that's a 180 degree mega tree now. So press close. Press OK there. Now I'm going to create a new sequence. It's going to be a time sequence. We'll let this load here. And we'll scroll down to our mega tree. Down at the bottom here. We'll add a nutcracker effect. And we'll click on it. I'm going to add the uh, butterfly because I really like that effect. We'll do a rainbow. Press OK. And now, if we play it, you should see it in our preview. And that's it. In a nutshell, had to add a mega tree 